everyone and welcome back to the Green Family Legacy. We are back in Sims 4 and we are getting ready to wish goodbye, say farewell to Holly, our little our little blue-haired lovely artist back there, and Ash who oh yep, yeah, all right here, Ash. Hello! He's a little bit cranky this morning, but he has some eggs and toast, some scrambled eggs that he's eating. And the twins, we're gonna have them grow up today and move out, and I'm gonna miss them so much, but it is time to move on. Tate and Iris and Zoe and Lily are going to be turning into elders soon. Pine may or may not have gotten his girlfriend Devin expectant with a baby. We don't know. And Alia is going to be growing up rapidly and in fact I think she is actually going to try to befriend a lot of aliens and begin a whole new phase of alien sim integration inside of the like her little world. So I think that's going to be fun. I think uh, she actually met an alien the other day and I was just thinking a little while ago it would be fun if she could meet up with Cordell again and get to know him and help him like make friends and help him work out and like maybe change his outfit and just fit in better with humanity because I feel like that's what Cordell wants and that's why um, he, he picked up a human name and everything but he might be able to have Alia help him out with that so Alia might be a new alien uh, liaison on the planet so that would be pretty cool but yeah and by the way look at the kitchen it looks amazing I love this kitchen so I found a rug that wouldn't crash my game I need to be careful with that custom content I download and we decorated it with some adorable custom content look at this look at this extracted little bits and pieces oh my gosh look we've got a little extracted salad spoon and a little salad chopper upper uh cutting board we even have the uh strawberry basket that we sell over at the farmer's market that tate and iris run and i really like that a little jam jar some lettuce a little bit of spices over here that's not custom content but it's adorable our tea of course which is amazing oh my gosh that tea has proven to be an absolute lifesaver when we need to get sims in a specific mood we're gonna have to like brew pots and study up the tea even better I love the little hanging plants. Plants everywhere, plants everywhere. And by the way, I learned this amazing new thing. Check this out. So this super expensive $13,000 stove that we just put in the house. We can send Tate over here and he can actually brew herbal remedies inside now. Isn't that so exciting? He might be able to make a whole bunch more of them now. So I'm really excited about that. It would be fun to actually, <gasps> we should put up shelves. We should put little shelves here and put the elixirs and like the fruits and herbs and bits and pieces that he puts into the elixirs up here. That would be so cool. So we might do that pretty soon. But yeah, everybody's enjoying some nice breakfast. And as soon as Pine finishes his meal, he's going to make a couple cakes for the kids. Because it is, it is the birthday, the day we have been waiting for, as I mentioned. And it turns out that somehow Tate ended up with level 10 cooking skill. So I'm not exactly sure how that happened, but it did. So we're rolling with it. Whose phone is ringing? Who knows? Maybe they answered it. What's Lily doing? Lily is building her rocket ship. Check that out. Isn't that awesome? Is that Alia's phone? It's Alia's phone. Incoming call from Carolina Pancakes. That is so cool. I've never seen this little pop-up before, so let's take it. Hey, Alia Hanna. It's me, Carolina. Do you want to come to my birthday party? What? It's Carolina's birthday party? I've never gotten one of these. Birthday party extravaganza. Yes, let's go. Let's go to her birthday. And let's actually take um, Holly and Ash with us. Where's Ash? Ash, why can't I take you? Where are you? Oh, there you are. All right, let's take all the teens. So this is a surprise birthday party. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I haven't managed to like actually go on one of these yet, but these have been added with the patches, which adds so much for as much trouble as they can sometimes cause with breaking custom content. I think the new benefits that they add in are just fantastic. Like being able to go to someone's birthday party. How cool is that? Oh, it's almost like Carolina knew that today is the day that we were also aging up Ash and Holly. She's a pretty good friend with Ash too. So I'm excited. We're over to the Pancakes house to watch her grow up. All right, and here we are. Oh my gosh. Hi. Oh, who are you? Who the heck are you? What? Ash! I don't remember putting you in these party clothes, but I must have. He's dressed for a party. Oh. My. Gosh. Ash. Oh my gosh. And he just wants to, like, do push-ups. At least wish the birthday girl 
Like, ask about, just congratulate her. Don't you dare ask her about woohoo and all that nonsense. So there's like five hours remaining on her party. Or oh, are we the only ones here to Carolina's party? It looks like we are. Oh, Carolina's fine. She's like, yeah, it's my birthday. Oh my gosh. She definitely has some of her dad's features. Oh my goodness. Ash! That outfit is not the most flattering on you, but he's so, he's so, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Flamboyant. That's Ash. That's Ash in a nutshell. Who's this? Oh, it's just a random, random person. We're not going to worry. Is he coming to, oh, he's coming to make the cake at the party. How cool is that? And there's Bob. Okay. And Ollie is just going around cleaning up the whole house. The pancakes actually have a pretty nice house. I've actually never played them. Look, the guy is making making the cake now. Okay, and we're just like wandering around their house. There's Eliza. Here's Gabe. So friendly introduction to Gabe, I guess. Gabe, are you a pancake? Yeah, he's a pancake. So this is this is they have some unfortunate looking children, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but, yeah. Hi, yeah. Gabe! How are you? Oh. Let's see, I think we can tell a joke. Joke about penguins! Oh, oh, poor Holly! Oh, she really reeks! Holly, we're gonna sneak in here and take a bubble bath, I think. Alright, who's this? There's Gina Pancakes! Who? Gina! Wow, Gina! Okay. So apparently the pancakes can, like, have a pretty child. Fernando, are you, like, Fernando? I wonder if he's trying to, like, get with her here. Tell a gross joke? Ew. So apparently Mr. Bunny over here is telling a gross joke. No, don't pay, play blip block or, like, at someone's party. Is she friends with anybody here? Does she know anyone? I don't think she knows anyone. What should we do? Where's Carolina? Oh, she does know Carolina. Where's Carolina? Carolina's outside. Okay, so this is kind of like Alia's friend, Carolina. So let's have her come out here and do, do, do enthuse about the outdoors and tell a joke. Maybe compliment outfit for the birthday girl. Funny, tell a joke about monkeys. There's a very sad man. Ash, I totally, like, you're terrifying me, Ash. I'm not gonna lie. Um, and all he wants to do is level up his programming and try to hack something. So we might send him inside because he doesn't seem to be enjoying the conversation very much. Hey, sure Lily leaves for work Get soon. Bottom. So let's have him come Same over. Program, the hack, the listserv. And poor Holly has been cornered. So Holly's been cornered by Gabe. Why are you here, Mr. Crying Man? Apparently Mitchell's just here to cry at the poor girl's birthday party. Where'd the cake go? Someone made a birthday cake. This is so interesting. There's Eliza. Alright, we'll have him stop chit-chatting. Go inside. Oh, poor Holly. Yeah, we're gonna let her go ahead. She's gonna sneak in here and, like, take a bubble bath. It's her birthday too, and she's just like stinky and uncomfortable, and hopefully the bubble bath will help things. Oh no, the computer's been taken. What are you gonna do now, Ash? Are you gonna try to chase her off? Are you gonna do some push-ups? Oh, he's, he's just gonna chase her off her own computer. That's fine, and then we're gonna use her computer to hack into things. Oh look, he wants to- oh, he wants to cloud gaze with his sister! That's so cool! Let's have a happy birthday to me! Sweet. Is she growing up now? Where is she? Oh, here's another cake being made. Oh, here's the cake! Okay, let's come on down. Come on, kidlets. So Lily, Aunt Lily is off to work. That sucks. She's not going to be there for them to age up. That's so cool. So there's a cake. Okay, this is happening. Oh, you can nap in the chairs. That, has that always been a thing, being able to nap in the chairs? I don't recall it always being a thing. <gasps> Fruit and yogurt. This is cool. He's making all sorts of awesome food. Alia is like the only one who's doing a good job of being a good guest. She's like, yep, I'm sitting down, enjoying the party. Don't be gloomy, be happy. She likes meeting new people at least. 
She's just gonna chat with everybody. Uh, maybe friendly introduction. Ash, what are you doing? Don't be rude. Don't do a rude introduction. Oh, he's trying to go find his sister. There we go. Poor Holly. She's like, I'm gonna pass out. I'm so tired. Let's send her down here. She can nap in a chair if she needs to. Ash, let's... No, don't watch current channel. Make a friend. Ash wants to make a friend. Well, let's sit down. You can join in on the conversation. Maybe that'll help. I'm not sure how these birthday parties are supposed to go, so joke about mimes. We'll see how it goes. Musical chairs. He's still whipping together some food. Ooh, what's he making now? That looks like fruit. Ooh, that's definitely fruit. Look at that. That's a watermelon. Okay. What's it going to become? What are you making, sir? Come on. Where's the birthday girl, I wonder? Oh, it's more yogurt. I don't think he has a very high cooking skill. Oh, Alia has reached level 2 of the comedy skill. Alia is really social. I did not expect that. I'm just going to let her nap here. Oh, that's adorable. There you go. There you go, Holly. You just take a nap. Alright, where is the there's the birthday girl. We need to spend more time with her. Let's see, let's see. Can we make her a friend? Are we a friend yet? Heartfelt compliment. Congratulate. Do all of the kids who visit have to congratulate her on her birthday? Is that how it works? There we go. Now they can have a little time to chit chat. Your house looks awesome. Oh. Let's see. Enthuse about the outdoors. Are these two friends? Yeah, I think these two are friends. Yeah, they're good friends. Oh, that's adorable. Bright and day. I think the party's almost over. Compliment outfit again. Oh, that's so cute. She's like, so it's your birthday, huh? Oh, this is so cute. Yay! And Alia can now donate to online charities and flatter yeah. other sims. What's this? <gasps> the Orbital Pudding. That's so cool to see what people read. It's so cool to be able to visit their house. Holly is just sound asleep. Where's Ash? She's gonna go watch some sports. Your party outfit is too much, Ash. It is way too much. Oh my gosh. That's okay, as long as he's happy, I guess. He's stretching, having a good time. Miss Snooze News is still snoozing over here. There's yogurt for days. That's so funny. Look at all this yogurt. There's just yogurt everywhere. I'm going to move it over here so that the chef can continue making more food. Look at him. Is this more yogurt? I think this is more yogurt, like right here. The man can only make like one thing at a time, I think, or one, one recipe. All right, these two are still having a good time. We're just gonna stay here a little bit longer because this is a surprise birthday that I totally didn't expect. So we're just gonna stay here a bit longer. Cause Carolina, she looks like she could really use some friends backing her up on her birthday. And I don't mind. All right, almost done. Alia and Gina are gonna start talking. Are we almost done? Yeah, the party's almost done. <laughs> All right. Everybody's gathering around to chit chat and talk. Oh, oh! The siblings are hanging out. Even though Holly's like about to pass out on her feet. Thanks for coming. I had a really nice time. Yay! Okay, I guess we're done then. Okay. Well, that's interesting. I could have sworn like it would have been interesting to watch her grow up. She's still just a teen, though. Huh, I wonder if she's going to be like a young adult next time we see her. Goodbye, Carolina! Alright, everybody else on their way home? Yeah, everybody else is on their way home. Alright, so now let's go back home and have our birthday party, as belated as it is, and say goodbye to Ash and Holly. Don't worry, we will be following up with them. We'll touch in from time to time. Playing long on the lifespan of Sims actually gives us the benefit of being able to jump between the houses without losing a lot of ground on the different families. So I look forward to focusing on Holly and her misadventures or adventures. I just don't know what 
she's going to end up doing and focusing on Ash who's going to do the Animal Crossing challenge because I think it would be hilarious. I think he and Olivia would be a really cute couple too so we'll see if we can hook them up together. But yeah, now it's time to make their birthday cake and celebrate their party! Yay! Alright, back home. First things first, let's go ahead and have one of our birthday girls, uh, let's see, let's put this over here, let's send Holly over here to get a good nap, and then Tate, you come over here, and we're going to have Tate, let's see, can you bake anything? Not really. He doesn't have the baking skill, but he can cook all right, so let's have him go ahead, come on, cook, and what kind of cakes should we make? Let's see what the fanciest cake we can possibly make is. The blue confetti cake, the strawberry cake, let's see, hamburger cake, white cake, chocolate cake. What about the gourmet food? Can he make any of the gourmet food meals? Let's check. The black and white cake, yay! So he can make the cake. I think that uh, we need to do the black and white cake because they're turning into adults and it's a nice fancy cake if you ask me. And let's take the scraps of breakfast and feed them to Microbite. There you go, Microbite. I love our new kitchen! It's just so awesome! I can't wait to see what else about the house and the family is going to change to meet the growing needs of the new family members and the current family members. Like, I think we need to definitely redo an area for pine. Maybe we'll break up the living room. It's kind of a huge living room. We've only ever used half of it. So maybe we'll turn half the living room into an office for pine? I'm not sure. Hmm. Why? Everything breaks all the time. Oh my goodness. Or maybe we'll turn the downstairs into his bedroom and turn this into a nice little office area. It's got a great office feel to it. You know, just figuring out where we're going to put everybody. I think this is permanently, like this whole area up here is going to permanently remain uh, like in, in Lily's line. So it'll be Alia's space as time goes on. All right. Alia is feeling way playful. Oh my gosh. I've never seen her so playful before. Hey you, what are you doing? Are you cooking? Okay, he's still cooking. Don't you view anything. You keep cooking. You're making your kid's birthday cake. And Ash, we're getting you out of those clothes. Oh my gosh. Let's have you take a shower and get out of those clothes. Take a thoughtful shower and think about your, your wardrobe choices, sir. Alright, and we'll pull this over here. So they actually had a good time because they went to a party joy from going to a party. That's pretty cool. Oh my gosh, what are you doing over here? Tate, you're so adorable. I love his little outfit. Come on, Tate. Alright, he's getting fancy over here. How you doing, Alia? You want to plant something, huh? Well, we can actually have her- Hey, what are you doing? Oh, he's just trying to- Oh, look, he wants to find a fossil. I wonder if we can help him find a fossil real quick. Before it's time for the party. Um... Mushrooms. Let's jump over here. That's so unusual for Pine to have these kinds of wants. No, it's just this this crystal. Well, let's have him get a crystal just because. Oh, and he's so happy. He does love being outside too. So Alia loves being outside as well. Oh, she wanted to talk with her cousin. That's cool. Um. Oh, let's have her come out and evolve some of the plants that are ready for it. Evolve, evolve. What about the rose bush? Ah, the rose isn't ready to evolve. I wish it was, though. She can come talk to it if she wants to. What about the pristine grape? Not ready to evolve yet. Dang. We'll ever work on weeding it, at least. Alright, Ash has come outside. <gasps> the cake is done! The cake is done! Alright, time to wake everybody up and get them ready for the party. Good job, Tate. I'm so proud of you. Let's go ahead and add birthday candles. Oh, there we go. Oh my goodness. He's like, he looks so proud of himself. Look at his little face. He's like, yep, well, it's going to be something. I'm not going to dwell on this. I'm not going to dwell on this. We're just going to get him ready. We're just going to send the kids off. I'm going to be, I'm going to miss them so much though. All right. Come on, Holly. It's time. You're almost an adult. And Pine dug up a capsule. Come on home, Pine. You come here. We actually need to stop you weeding. Go here. And let's have Holly grow up first. So let's have her come over here and make a wish. Why not? Let's have her come over here and taste the frosting first. Oh, taste the frosting will age her up. So let's have her come over and 
make a wish. And let's bring everyone in here. Come on. I want everybody to be able to celebrate. Come on. Oh, that's unusual for Zoe to want to go upstairs and look through the telescope. Right, is everybody coming? Come on. Oh, it's so sweet. Oh my gosh, look at Iris. She's like, yeah, party it up. Oh, Holly, I'm going to miss you. There you go, Holly. She's working at it. Holly Green's now a young adult. She looks no different. <gasps> That's amazing! Holly aged up. Young adulthood, lifelong responsibilities, burgeoning careers, and vast horizons await. Whoever said their 20s aren't a blast. So she is already um, creative and a loner. And we get to pick a new trait for her. I think I have a few new ones installed. Mm, what would be her trait? A music lover, for sure. She definitely is a music lover. There we go. All right, there you go, Holly. Oh, I can't believe she's an adult, just like that. It seems so totally surreal. Where's your twin? What are you doing? Don't mold the clay. Where'd that evil clay come back from? He's like, I don't want to grow up. So let's have him come over. There's those, and let's have him taste the frosting. Don't you guys dare. Okay, they're all coming to celebrate the fact that she just grew up. Look at them crowd around here. They're like, we're going to miss you. Though really, since Pine stayed, it must seem surreal to them, the idea that someone isn't moving out. All right, let's see. Let's have her go ahead. Brighten day. Let's have you turn around and show off an outfit to your aunt. Oh, here we go, here we go. Where's your dad? Where's your dad? Get over here, Tate. <laughs> oh, look at the family. Oh, wow, there's like no transition. Oh, Ash just aged up. All right, so he's a geek who is still athletic. And he's always energized, so I feel like Hyper... Hyper would actually... Yeah, and becomes angry when deprived of fun. Hyper fits him. Hyper really does fit him. <laughs> so there we go. I can't believe that happened so quickly. But yeah, Ash is now an adult. It actually seems to suit him very well. And yes, I know it's almost Zoe's birthday, but we're not going to focus on that fact just yet. She only has another week of adulthood. <gasps> oh, yeah, why are your parents so much older than you? And there we go, you guys. So that's that. And I'm going to actually pack up all of Holly's things into her inventory and pack up Ash's things into his inventory. But don't worry. It's just that the house is getting kind of crowded and the twins are feeling like they are ready to kind of stretch their wings and go elsewhere. Holly, I think, really wants to move into an apartment. She's much more of a loner. And I think that being surrounded by so many people and more people coming in all the time into the family stresses her out. So we're going to move Holly out into her own apartment and Ash is going to have his house there with her, but then move in temporarily for the Animal Crossing challenge that we're going to do with him in the future so thank you guys so much so just like that look at her she looks so much like her mama you look a lot like your mom you have your dad's chin though and it looks good on you oh uh, so they've grown up they've grown up they're young adults now and we'll have to, to transition them onward and move them forward and hopefully have a chance to bring <laughs> yeah he's like okay son it's time for you to bring in bring in the money bring in the job bring in the lady and the pine's like don't even talk to me about that dad you didn't even ever get a formal job so yeah next it'll be time to let pine really shine push him further in his career and try to get the lovely Devin or whoever he decides to stay with because i'm kind of nervous at all the lovely other people he's meeting lately but we'll see who he wants to pick and where he wants to go from there and i will see you guys later Bye bye <laughs>